it's Sharon from Sherry's Fairies. Well, welcome to my channel. So, I started following this lady on YouTube, and her name is Cindy Marie. And there's a group of ladies that get together, get together every Tuesday. They post a video on Tiny Tidy Tuesday. I thought that was a great idea, and that way I could get a few products, few little things done around my house where I've wanted to tidy up and just haven't taken the time. So I thought, well, if I make this commitment, then I'll have to do a little bit of tidying anyhow, and some see how things go. Also, I know Cindy Marie, isn't the person who started the Tiny Tidy Challenge, but I don't remember the lady's name who does. So when I figure it out, I'll put it in my description. <laughs> so anyhow, this is going to be my first Tiny Tidy Tuesday. And I thought I would start with my linen closet. It doesn't have a lot of linen in it, but it has a lot of messy towels. So, pretty sure you can see that pretty good. There we go. We have this shelf of towels and this shelf of towels. So I'm going to haul them out. And... I'm going to roll them up and organize them. I put my work table here by the closet, right in front of me. And I'm just going to start hauling things out of there and sorting things out as I go. See, these are not towels, those are pillowcases. <laughs> but anyhow, we'll take all these towels out. There's big ones and there's little ones. Okay. Now we've got lots of room to work. So, starting with the top. Taking everything out. Oh, we've got all sorts of towels in here. I inherited towels from my mom and my dad, and I inherited towels from David's mom and dad. So I have all sorts of all different colors and towels when they're in good shape. I don't want to waste them. So I just kept them. Now I need to tidy them up. That's my husband. That's my husband's golf one. For when you're golfing. This is a table runner. I have another table runner. Well, that's good. I forgot about those. Okay. So let's see. I'm going to take the largest towels. A few beach towels. Fold them in half lengthways. And then fold them in half this way. And now I'm going to roll them. And we're going to place them in the cupboard. I'm going to place them in the cupboard like that, and I'm going to put all the big ones first. So, And I like to put this in facing out 
I'm not that in because I think this end looks tidier. But now we'll start our second row of towels. And they'll be in different sizes. Same way. Should have taken a before and after. <laughs> I always forget to do that. It doesn't matter what project I'm doing. But it's going to be so nice to have this linen covered. A little bit organized. So when I open the door, things don't fall out on me. <laughs> yes. And we'll know where things are. Looking pretty good so far. I know it's not a, a lot of fun to watch. Somebody folding towels and rolling them, sticking them in a cupboard. We do get to have a visit. Okay, now I've got this size. This one's, well, it's kind of ripped up, but we still use it. And it was already rolled. <laughs> so I did, did start out with my cover with rolled towels. There we go. Okay, let's get these ones in there rolled up. We can do these ones different. We'll do it half this way and then that way. And then roll them up. That kind of shows you more what size they are. So I've got larger towels on the bottom and medium ones. Now I'm putting the smaller bath towels on top of that so we'll keep going with that and see how that works these are a nice color for easter actually <laughs> these towels are quite pretty for easter good grief All on the floor. There's another pillowcase. Put on the chair. Okay, let's get this towel. My work table that I bought. To do my crafts on has come in handy because it rolls around we can roll it quickly out into the living room and use it as a serving bar where we can put goodies and stuff when we have guests on even though this was a, a free towel out of a Honey Nuts Cheerio box. It's pretty thin. I think I'll do it the same way I did the big ones. And because it's thin, it'll fold down pretty small. I don't have to decide what I'm doing with the rest of the towels. Now that I got these ones, let's one more fold and then we'll roll. Okay, I 
have a number of face cloths. And I like my face cloths. I used to take my makeup off with my face cloths. But now I use those wipes you can buy. And I have some tea towels. Because I only have one drawer in my kitchen. And for tea towels, which is very small. The other drawers I put pots and pans in. So now I've got to clean out the second cupboard. I'll take you there and show you. Well, <clears throat> I did finish my project, but somehow I lost the video. I'm working on a new program, trying to figure things out. So anyhow, when I left you, I was going to start the second shelf. And so I did. I rolled up all my hand towels and stacked them there. Put all my face cloths in between. Those are tea towels at the back. And I rolled up my dish cloths. That's how I put them in my drawer. So that's the second shelf all done. And there's the first shelf with all the towels. I'm so pleased. It's so nice to open this cupboard and not have things fall on you and be able to locate things like a hand towel or a face cloth or a dishcloth. So that's my tiny tidy for this Tuesday. I really, really enjoyed doing this tiny tidy. And I think it's a great idea. And I hope you enjoyed watching it. And if you enjoyed this, please subscribe and watch all the other Tiny Tidy Tuesdays that the girls are putting up. I don't think there's any men. <laughs> there could be. Anyhow, thanks again very much for inviting me. And thanks again to everyone who watched. And please, please subscribe. Thank you. Bye.